intelligent people probably don't do this sport, or at least they tap and things start popping, but got something inside me that doesn't want anybody else to be better than me. I love the sport. I want to inspire people. That's why I do it. That's how I justify doing this is that I, you know, that people can see me doing something with all my heart and it'll give them the courage to do what they want because I don't like hurting people. I do like winning, so it feels good to win, but, uh, you know, I don't know. I just, I just hope that something good can come out of this, that, that somebody out there who, who sees me triumphing over adversity and, and working hard, that that'll inspire somebody who can go out and do something other than beating people up, you know? Inspire somebody to go adopt a kid or, or man up and, you know, take a chance, do something good for the world. You know, uh, I don't necessarily think that me going out there and beating people up is good for the world, but if I can inspire somebody to do something that is, you know, then, then maybe all this is worth it. Part of me believes I can be a world champion. It's what I wanted. Uh, wanted to be a champ since I was a little kid. And, uh, you know, that pursuit of excellence, that pursuit of greatness is, is it what, you know, it's what inspires me. It, uh, it's what makes me wake up in the morning, you know, hold my head high, knowing that I'm doing the right thing and that I'm, I'm chasing, uh, chasing a dream. But, uh, you know, I guess some days are, are easier than others. Some days are, are hard, but, uh, I know that the universe never gives us anything that we can't handle. So just like all my other injuries, my losses, I'm sure I'm going to come back stronger. I just hope that, uh, that one day I can make enough money in this sport that I can retire and open a gym and start taking care of other people and start helping other people reach their goals. Uh, growing up, my dad was my wrestling coach, and he would, uh, he would take guys into our house. I had bunk beds, and there was always somebody sleeping on the top bunk that was having a rough time, you know? And... Uh, that to me is like one of the most beautiful things ever to have that ability to help people out and take kids who are who don't have anything and give them something, give them a shot at something. And uh, Chris Riley at, at Legends MMA, he's got a gym and he lets people stay there. You know, he takes kids in and lets them stay there and train and chase their dreams and gives them jobs. And uh, I just want to follow in that that you know that path. I want to give back.